Welcome to the 2019 Hudson Valley Jazz Festival. It's our 10th season with 21 performances in a variety of locations throughout Orange County and the greater Hudson Valley. It's been a thrill to host artists like the Vanguard Jazz Orchestra, Arturo Farrell, Wallace Roney, John Abercrombie, Lenny White, and Adam Nussbaum. The goal of this music series, which I think may be different than some of the other ones, is not that we're celebrating these great giants of jazz who deserve that recognition, but we're calling attention once again to the fact that there are many musicians who deserve wider recognition. The Hudson Valley is home to jazz musicians and places for live jazz each week. We're here to honor the tradition of jazz, the hardworking musicians, and show appreciation for the venues that hire and the supporting public. They're swing, modern, improv, fusion, and bop. You can enjoy a concert at a performing arts center, a library, an art gallery, an afternoon or evening in a park, or dinner and jazz in a restaurant. See the full schedule at HudsonValleyJazzFest.org or you can reach us at 917-903-4380. Come to the Hudson Valley. There's amazing opportunities up here. There's amazing musicians up here. Um, the air is clean. You get a lot of uh, inspiring um, vistas, mountains, lakes, streams, quaint little villages, and, uh, and, and some really hip little spots to, to hang out, listen to good music, or play with some amazing musicians. Speak love, darling, speak love, love is a spark lost in the dark. There were more and more places that uh, were interested to have jazz and uh, also that has become a, a beautiful um, community and I don't have to travel that often into the city uh, to play gigs anymore. I'm just uh, trying to see if I can get more work upstate. There's a lot of different scenes up here. There's uh, the Warwick scene, of course. There's Woodstock, New York. There's Beacon, New York. There's a lot of different things going on. And um, we're finally starting to see them all come together. I've gotten a chance to work with Buster Williams, also with uh, Will Calhoun. And uh, I've, I've worked with uh, Dave Holland. Uh, I was with his group for three years. I've done some work with McCoy Tyner's big band, Ronald Shannon Jackson, uh, great drummer, Chico Hamilton, World Saxophone Quartet. And uh, I have my own groups, Metaphor, Trio Kinesis, and uh, 10 CDs out. But uh, yeah. I, I've been around. There's <laughs> a lot of great talent up here that's uh, undiscovered, and uh, I think the Hudson Valley Jazz Festival will continue to help expose their talents to wider, wider recognition. Well, the Hudson Valley is certainly, if you are from the area, then you already know it's a very ripe area for the arts. There are tons of authors and painters and musicians and all kinds of people have made the Hudson Valley their home. And those of us who now live here are keenly aware of that, but it's always been known. So there's always been a great supply of great musicians up in this area. to become a part of a really strong music community. Uh, one that has exposed me to different kinds of playing that I may never have been exposed to living in New York City, believe it or not. 
Moving up here and meeting the musicians I've uh, met up here and played with has been a very rewarding experience. One of the best things that's happened up here is we formed a group called Inner Route, which is a free improv quartet. And um, from the very first time that we all played together, it was actually a wonderful experience. I look forward to seeing you in August, and we appreciate your support, and um, welcome to the Hudson Valley.